long. Picture this. You're part of a cleanup crew where every job feels a bit too shady for comfort. Your mission? Clean up an accident without leaving a trace. In hazard pay, your job is to clean up someone else's mess, but watch out. Hazards lurk everywhere around every corner. And trust me, you don't want to find out what happens when you mess up on the job. As you unravel the secrets of your employer, IPT, the game keeps you on your toes with clever puzzles and a gripping atmosphere that will have you questioning who the real villain is. So if you're ready to scrub away the truth and maybe laugh nervously at your own choices, grab your gear and let's see if you can clean up without getting caught. Number two. Ever felt like you needed help getting stuff done? Well, let me introduce you to Range, the ultimate productivity tool that turns your to-do list into a scenic drive. Created by DevDuck, you can choose how long you wanna work, pick a task, and hit the road in your custom vehicle. Whether you're cruising through snowy mountains or the coastal highway, each drive helps you tackle distractions while leveling up and unlocking cool new cars and accessories. Plus, after each session, you can kick back with a well-deserved break. Buckle up and let range turn your work sessions into an enjoyable adventure. Be sure to check out the free coding courses from this week's sponsor, Cody. Cody is a practice-driven website for learning how to code. You can get access to free or pro-level courses and coding challenges across major coding languages like Python or C-sharp. There isn't GDScript, but the Python courses will give you a great foundation that can then be migrated over to GDScript pretty quickly. You can learn about object-oriented programming, how to use lambdas, or jump into C-sharp and follow the very basics like variables, operators, or flow statements. The course screens provide guidance and a script editor side by side. Challenges ask you to write new code and the site will check your results providing you XP if you're correct. If you're new to programming and don't know where to start, Cody is definitely worth checking out to see if you like the free courses with even more to offer at the pro level. Number three. If you've ever wanted to work the night shift in a museum where the exhibits come to life, you want to check out the Night Museum where you step into the shoes of a lowly night clerk juggling ticket sales and cash handling while trying to get a grip on your sanity. Now, this ain't no Ben Stiller kids movie because as the nights get creepier, you'll find yourself cleaning up after some rather messy visitors and facing a gallery of horrors that don't just sit there and look pretty. With retro inspired visuals and a heart pounding first person perspective, every shift is a new nightmare where one wrong move can turn you into the next exhibit. So gear up, keep your wits about you and see if you can survive the five increasingly terrifying nights or risk becoming just another ghost story in the museum's dark history. Number four. They're easy to draw, Blender loves them. I'm talking about cubes. And in Cubitory, you'll become a factory tycoon designing an intricate system of mining drills, conveyor belts, and stampers to create colorful cubes that will take the gaming world by storm. What sets this game apart is its chill vibe. There are no pesky enemies or ticking clocks, just pure factory building bliss. As you unlock new technologies and upgrade your supply lines, you'll find yourself in a satisfying loop of production perfection, where every tweak can lead to greater efficiency. So if you've ever dreamed of running a factory without worrying about workers' comp, Cubatory is your ticket to cube creating glory. And before we get to our last spot, congrats to last week's winner, Penguin Festival. Be sure to vote for your favorite in the comments to have them included in this year's Gato Game Awards. And like last year, just because a game doesn't win its week, it doesn't mean it can't be included in the awards. Number five. Step right up to the hilarious chaotic world of Cooper's Supermarket where you'll dive into the life of a cashier. And check out Cashier Simulator, you can forget about those boring 9 to 5 jobs. Here you're scanning, bagging, and taking payments from a whirlwind of customers, all while racing against the clock. With over 300 quirky products and 20 departments, every shift feels fresh, and trust me, you'll want to group those items for bonus points because who doesn't love a little extra cash? Between ringing up groceries, you can mingle with your colorful co-workers, each with their own stories that'll keep you entertained during those slow moments of the day. And let's not forget the glory of topping the leaderboards because we all love a little competition, even if it means surviving overtime. Welcome to your new retail adventure. And remember, if you're working on a game or hobby project in the Gato engine, you too can be featured in This Week in Gato and the new hobby game video is coming soon. Just use the links in the description to submit your project. 